You guessed it, it's that time again. It's time for the craziest game show broadcast on UHF throughout the Asia Pacific region. It's Crazy Crosswords, and now the host of the show, Steel Jetson. Good evening, and. Hey man, the studio orchestra, the, studio orchestra. the crazy crossword orchestra, the one man orchestra because uh, we can only afford the one man orchestra. <laughs> and I have been saying in the past that he is an illegal immigrant from Bermuda. That's a joke. I, want to, I say that because there are public servants out there who have actually run Keith and asked him to come in for an interview at immigration. <laughs> True. Stupid. It's a joke. It's crazy crosswords. Don't take it seriously. Unless it's velvet, of course, because this is a serious woman. <laughs> Wow, the we've testosterone level a, has just gone in here. We've actually got an audience today. It's really great. It's good, it's isn't really it? It's really exciting having audience people like looking at us. Yeah. Stage fright. Oh my god. The goodness. laughter's not canned, just the audience. <laughs> <laughs> actually, I've got a story to tell. Mm -hmm. I was in the city the other day and I had this wonderful young lady come up to me and say Thank you, thank you. And say uh, that she's a if great I'd said fan. That, you'd clap. She's I mean good. that she's a wonderful fan and that she and her friends colour in ping pong balls to play. The show. Yeah. I know it was a little bit of a worry, and she gave me a photo, and she begged me oh to put God, it on I TV. Bet but Melrose as well. I forgot the photo, so I sort of drew a picture. <laughs> um, Jules, that's sort of look. That's sort of what she looked like. So she knows who she is anyway. Oh, she's a spunk. Sort of like that. Yeah, I thought you'd like Strange her. Strange head shape. Though, and isn't Bernie, it? that's Bernie there. I couldn't sort of tell Bernie. I didn't see him in person, but that's them. That's our one and only probably fans, except for this guy over here. <laughs> I just yeah. sort of say hello. <laughs> An artist or what? Multi talented. Look, he's, he's got a, a Michael Jackson nose. Look, there's two little holes in his <laughs> face. Look, it's, it's a little bubby one. <laughs> Isn't it cute? Little ski slope. <laughs> it's beautiful. And we've got Bruce and Stella back with us today. Hey guys. And they really want to win because they said, if you didn't talk so much, we would have won. <laughs> you mean if you didn't talk, we could have won the prizes? Like, are they real prizes? <laughs> and I went, sorry, it was his fault. <laughs> but it wasn't. That was my Mr. Vine impersonation. And who have we got in the blue team? People who haven't got real names. Two K people with D. letters, D and K. <laughs> D and K. And then the noisy ones who in last night's show were giving all the answers. Let's see if they can actually get them tonight That's when they're really right. playing. I remember you, D. You're the one we're going to send into Coventry. Well, let's see how smart you are and if you can win the game tonight, eh? Yeah. And I bet, I bet you, when, once you're in front of the cameras, though, it's different. It's like... Oh, that's right. <laughs> this is like real TV. This is show business stuff. Well, it's showy anyway, isn't it? It's flashy, whatever. Glitzy. Oh, and that's about it. Should we do it? You should do it. I'm going to go over here. Okay. Crossword time. Cross to the words. One across. Little... One across. But I think before we do that, we usually get rid of those winning prizes. I find it boring, less gratuitous sort of payola and, yeah, and promotional stuff. So let's have a look at that. Quickly go and make yourself a cup of tea in the microwave and we'll have a look at what our winners are in for tonight. Thanks very much, Steel. Tonight's contestants receive these fabulous prizes. You'll go on a magnificent trip to SeaWorld on the fabulous Gold Coast from SeaWorld. And then, of course, you're off on a magnificent return cruise up and down the glorious Brisbane River on the historic Miramar. That, of course, comes to you from Miramar Cruises as you head towards your lunchtime destination, Lone Pine Koala Sanctuary. Have lunch with a rat at Lone Pine Koala Sanctuary. And of course, it's time you're off with Gary on the back of his uh, Harley Davidson from Hardly Detours. And then it's time to get wet and have an incredible wild time at Australia's premier aquatic fun park, Wet and Wild. And then it's up the road to Movie World, Hollywood on the fabulous Gold Coast. From Warner Brothers Movie World and all of these prizes from Crazy Crossword. Yeah. 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 Might, um, do a quick little plug. Anyone who wants percussion lessons from an absolute master, 892-5415. That's Keith's number. And this man does... Get that energy level up for us. Before we play crosswords, Keith, let's hear some djembe. Ah! 
Yes. Oh, the yeah. ritual vibe, the voodoo drums. Let's do some crosswords. Uh, one, across. one across. To leave the country to reside in another country is two. Gold team. Immigrate. Emigrate it is. <laughs> Five minutes of crazy crosswords makes you want to sort of emigrate, doesn't it? <laughs> one down. Out of range. Like Turinga. Um, one down. Uh, this could describe me a little bit nutty, usually different from others. Uh, Let's put it this way, if you're rich they call you this, if you're not, you're mad. Mm -hmm. Word is eccentric indeed. Yeah. Oi, that's a good one. How's that go? Yeah. Oh, nice hey, catch. Spicy. Yeah. <laughs> Four across. Did you say what? Very well. Nothing. Uh, no, I Innocent don't. smile again. Four across. Four across, okay. Um, the moulding around a room just below the ceiling. Cornus. Cornus. Two down. Two down. Things that irritate are called blue team. Irritations. Uh, things that cause yeah. irritations are irritants. Irritants. Yes. Okay, there you go. Beautiful. <laughs> Now, gold team, you did have the option to jump in there too, and you, you're about to. But. Oh, I did. Now I tell you. Yeah. The rules are really inspiring. Rules? Rules? What are you, a law student or something? Show before. You must never have seen the show before. I mean, expected to win prizes, expects to know the rules. Hey, shut up or no one's going to win already. <laughs> Look, I get to say shut up. <laughs> okay, I didn't mean it. I'm sorry. I just, she says it to me all the time. I have feelings. We love Velvet. <laughs> <laughs> Oi! See, I'm the innocent bystander here. That's good. Eight across. Eight across. Uh, <laughs> Oh my goodness, I've never seen that word before. Let me have a look here. Oh, it's one of those. It's an abbreviation. Hurry up. For the National Society of Operative Printers, Graphical and Media Personnel. <laughs> How's your short-term memory? The National Society... Yes, Goldie. NATO. No, no. <laughs> well done. Oh, Bruce, this is here, clever boy. No, no, look, just, just, uh, just, just remember the letters. National Society. There's no of, actually. That doesn't even fit. How does that national society? <laughs> They're never going to get Nat Soper. Nat Soper. <laughs> well done. Wow! I just won that. I give it. I reckon. Yeah, I reckon Give that's me a really bogus. That's that is bogus. That's bogus. You think that's bogus? Check this out. Tonight's contestants will not receive these fabulous prizes. You'll travel by magnificent, sleek, air-conditioned airliner to the middle of the Sahara Desert, where you'll then meet up with four Bedouin tribesmen and search for some lost pyramids. And of course, the locals will entertain you in the style only they know how. Priced at $25 from Shocky Travel. Hey fellas, you look stylish with your own space anomaly. With electrons and protons, it comes to you from Hans Frippel Gromer Space Anomalies, of course. All these prizes courtesy of Crazy Crossword. Nat Soper. Just, it's worse than necklace, isn't it? <laughs> Three down. <sighs> Three down. Um, Took something which was given. Gold team. Accepted. Oh. oh. Colour blind Gold and team. pushy. <laughs> you were, weren't you? I, I could tell, I could just tell. I could see but you were forming the middle vowel. Uh, uh. <laughs> no rules. <laughs> no rules. No rules. <laughs> no rules. <laughs> no, no. Uh, I, this, we are the rules. We are. <laughs> we are the rules. We, we are, are the people. Yeah, whatever. <laughs> we're six Tough down. day. Six down. Six down. Uh, the only thing in life which is permanent is <coughs> gold team. Death. Yeah. Death's not really permanent because you come back again, don't you? No. I don't really. Understand. That was pretty. St the only thing permanent is something. Well, what's something which is not permanent? What What is something that you get when you spend a dollar and you get a lot of loose change? change. <laughs> Okay, whose buzzer was that? Gold team. <laughs> oh, <my God. laughs> I like those rules. <laughs> I'll fix you up afterwards. Yeah, mate. <laughs> Goes without saying. Oh, seven across. Each. <laughs> <laughs> no. Each. Each? Is that right? No, it's not. No, it's not. There you go. To, to sort of scratch Great. out a kind Itch, of picture. Etch, right? etch, oh. all right. You can have it. Yeah. <laughs> I'm too scared to argue with these 
Two contestants. Yeah, get on with it. Uh, Nine across. <laughs> Nine across. <laughs> Be bitter. Give constant pain. Uh, rhymes with ankle. <laughs> Blue team. Rankle. Rankle, must, eh? <laughs> yeah, rankle us a bit. Give us some rankle. Boy, that, that, that rankled, didn't it? Eleven across, uh, something that the king lives in, and the queen castle. in the castle, blue team, beautiful yeah. young. Okay. Oh, they mucked it up again. Don't worry about it. No rules, no rules, and no ads, just words from our sponsors. Don't worry about it, it's only TV. I'm just, just looking at the crossword. Yeah, it's a worry. It's a worry, isn't it? There's, there's some really we'll difficult stuff across. there. Doesn't matter, we'll, we'll blunder through it. How are we going with um, our count so far? Gold team? Five. Five, five. 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 And these people are really competitive. They're having <laughs> practice. Right. Little team meetings. Tell me they'll beat the living daylights out of me if they don't win. <laughs> That's great. <laughs> That's not us. <laughs> I'll just Where? watch. Should we do it? Um, oh, we've got a little floor manager thing happening there. Do you want to uh, throw to that one, Velva? Just to just we totally can. confuse everyone. Let's have everyone. a look what our losers are going to be taking home with them tonight. Oh, good camera switching, guys. Yeah, that's me. Thanks very much, Velva. Tonight's losing contestants receive these fabulous prizes. You'll take home these premium quality Australian nuts and morsels from Mary Ram. With unmatched natural goodness, quality and freshness, they come to you, compliments of Mary Ram nut distributors. Yeah, big deal. And then enjoy the latest movie releases at Birch Carol and Coyle Cinemas. They got everything there, including movies and sweets and treats at Birch Carol and Coyle Cinemas. All of these lugubrious prizes, courtesy of Crazy Crossword. Yeah. yeah! Lugubrious. Rather lugubrious, isn't it? This entire show. This, when you watch this show at home, do you get the feeling that it's like really unrehearsed and like no one knows what they're doing? No, it looks yeah, very scripted. professional. On my television. Shut up. Does it? You, what, you don't get a good reception or what? <laughs> <laughs> that's, that's very professional static. <laughs> oh, do you, do you, what do you reckon, Bruce? Uh, it's, it's not too bad. Uh, it's, always, it's better than the news. Better than the news. <laughs> it's a bit gorier though, isn't it? Uh, it's taking place at home and away at our house. Can we um, put me back on the monitor for a second? I'll just there we go. Straighten up. You have to look professional. So I'm just trying to avoid doing this crossword because it's a really I don't know. Well, some do twisted down. mind. Uh, one down. Maybe no, that's okay. That's, that's, that's an easy piece. one. The person who runs a hotel. Gold team. Proprietor. Oh, we're blue. Sorry. Yeah, it's okay. You got it wrong anyway. <laughs> Badum. Um, Publican. Shit. No, hang on. These guys were in with the buzzer. What, what was the question again? What was the question? You just got the answer and you want the question. I mean, look, I'll give it to you guys. <laughs> no. No, no, no. If you didn't take the opportunity, mate. They say, all you had to say was publican, right? You knew that was the answer. You want the question you again? No, you've, you've just got to listen. You can play this too. Now it's dirty. When you lose, it's dirty. When you win, it's great. That's nice. right. Um, six across. Six across. Um, yes, it's, it's not exactly a pimple I've got here. Just call it a, a sort of a little... Blackhead. Blackhead, no. <laughs> oh, no. That was his no, discussion no, earlier. No, no. It's when your skin is, you get a, you get a sort of a mark, a blue team is right, a blemish. <laughs> oh, excuse me. Don't forget buzzers, guys. Don't forget to press the buzzers. Press the, the old buzzerino. <laughs> of course, you guys would never have a blemish, would you? I have a fairly blemished That's career. That's how you do it. See? Mine works. Oh, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> People are a big worry, a really big worry. People are a big worry, and uh, not just the ones in the studio, but the ones we meet on the streets. Isn't that great? You don't even see her lips move when she talks. <laughs> oh, let's go to Vox Pops. That's it. Hi, bye. <laughs> Vox Pops. Well, what, what can I do for you? Oh, I don't know. What can you do for me? Good question. Yeah. <laughs> still, still, can we have your autograph? Can we have your autograph? Yuppie bimbos. Where do you guys you yes. from? Yes. Crazy Crossword. <laughs> we watch it every night. This is not a setup. Seven. <laughs> 
All right. This is are you in communications with um, with Jim Sawley at the moment? Or? No, no, it's Jim's out. Jim's out. Right? So you're sort of minding the shop, are you? Yeah. Oh, it's good to see. So you've, you've got you're protected there from what vandals? Is that for, what are these tools for? Self defence. Um, basically, yeah, manholes. <laughs> well, that sounds decidedly dodgy. <laughs> Mountain climbing today? Nope. Nope, you look very well equipped for the uh, conditions. Yeah, no, just ease of carrying. Yeah, it's a good idea, and the, the parker to keep you warm. Yeah. Out for a bit of a stroll? Yeah. I don't, I don't speak in English very good. Oh, where are you from? Uh, South America. So, hola, ¿qué tal, amigo? ¿Qué tal? Sure. <laughs> so, it was someone I knew. <laughs> Fine, uh, thanks for that. That's okay. That's okay. Sydney. Manholes down there have a whole different connotation. Oh, right, alright. That's cool. <laughs> Just keep kicking your wallet, you know what I mean? Yeah. So, um, what do you think about the French nuclear tests? Well, it's not very nice. As far as they're concerned, not proper. Because it's only a little bloody out coral atoll that they're trying to blow up. And uh, could leak out, and it can and is possible to leak out at any time if the coral or the rest of the blooming rock, the balsam rock like cares to give way. We're not too sure about atomic energy yet, so it's got to be something that's got to be done with very great care and consideration. As I said, do it like the, like the rest of them in their own backyard or somewhere else, okay, but uh, we've been pretty well nu nuclear fair since they since they stopped doing it over in South Australia, so let's try and keep it that way. I know what they're trying to do, but uh, let them find somewhere else to do it. That's just all there is. That's well said. Okay. Bonjour. Ooh. And I think a big hand for our director tonight, Stevie Wonder is mixing the cameras. <laughs> Great job, Steve. Hey, have you seen uh, Phil lately? Phil. Have you seen Phil lately? <laughs> Doesn't matter. No, Let's I just go on with the cross. One across. <laughs> One across. The true name for stamp collecting. Uh, gold team. Uh, calligraphy or something. Actually, I have seen Phil lately. Have you? Yes. Yeah, so I have. Phil's Phil. Phil. Uh, blue team. <laughs> Phil lately, not <laughs> Phil. <flat>. Yes. <laughs> I mean, who but an absolute nerd who actually collects stamps would know that? I don't know. Um, is there any there that's in the common vocabulary of two human down beings? Is. Uh, two down is, yes. The Titanic struck what? Dalton. Oh, oh, it's a buzzer game here. I mean, it's, you know, if Glenn Ridge were here, he'd be slapping you around for that. I'd really enjoy that. Oh, you're saying you wouldn't enjoy it if Steele did it? Oh. Did I say that was for the blue team? Oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> What's that? <laughs> what is that? <laughs> oh, isn't that beautiful? Oh. Nice nature element to our show. <laughs> do, do, do. I think five down. Five down. Okay, a Sanskrit word which actually means discipline, uh, a form of relaxation and meditation. Blue team? Yoga. 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 Yes. If you do it really natural with no clothes on, it's yoga bear. <laughs> <laughs> oh, do uh, ten across. I want can to you see do how a you do this one. Yeah, thanks. That's probably shouldn't have even dignified oh, it with a badoom, should we? We should dignify it. Something even more interesting than a badoom. This is. Gary <laughs> Hall. Welcome back. Welcome, welcome, most welcomingly. Um, to our humble set. It's a sad, that sad it's moment. It's a very isn't it? sad moment. We have to say goodbye to some of our contestants. Who's it going to be? Hands up if you're a loser. <laughs> <laughs> the <laughs> whole audience. <laughs> Great. Yeah. Uh, well, in the specific sense that we refer to, it's Bruce and Stella, I'm afraid. So let's give them a big round of applause. <laughs> Go. Chalo, chalo, baba, chalo. 
Oh, oh, they just moved straight over to the winner's couch. Think they're important now, These, these are they? the sort of women you ask for a barbecue and they're in your house three weeks later, right? And all their friends and their feet up on your table. You're the, yeah. yeah. God, you visitors from hell. Oh, oh dear. Not from hell but I have this terrible feeling that we're not going to get rid of these ladies <laughs> for quite some time, but hey. We'll screw Oh, dear. What? They'll scream, they said. No, she said she screams. <laughs> Don't say anything. Don't say anything. It's too easy. It is. It's too easy. Winning this game mightn't be too easy, no, but if we no. do manage to finish it, D and K and J and F and, and you anyone, and any other letters else, out there. We'll be winning these prizes that uh, we're about to show you, which are just amazing. Fantastic. Beautiful. Pretty good. Thanks very much, Steel. Tonight's contestants will receive these fabulous prizes. We'll spend a fantastic day out at SeaWorld on the fabulous Gold Coast with Squirt the Whale from SeaWorld. And then, of course, they're off on that fantastically boring return cruise up and down the glorious brown Brisbane River, historic Miramar. That's from Miramar Cruises as they head towards their lunchtime destination. To where? <gasps> Lone Pine Koala Sanctuary. And then, of course, they're off with Gary and the Harley Davidson from Hartley Detail. Time to get wet and have a wild time at Wet and Wild Water Park. And of course it's up the road to Movie World, well, the Hollywood of the fabulous Gold Coast. This prize comes from Warner Brothers Movie World and all of these prizes from... Crazy Crossroads. That's correct. That was a fun day out. It was. We don't get any of those things though. We just get the pleasure of being here in the studio. We just, we just massage our egos in the knowledge that seven people are watching us do it. That's right. Seven people think we're nothing important at all. One down. I'm looking at a totally different crossword here. <laughs> oh, don't tell me. 2C? No. Excuse me. No, 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 no. Just, just, oh. are you looking at... Oh, now, uh, how, how can you get fleece <laughs> in there? Oh, okay. Right. Yeah. Okay. It just happens sometimes. Da, 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 da. <laughs> just <laughs> one across. Sheep have Please. Well done. <laughs> Did you fix it like that? Was that all it was? Just yeah, the one. Just Boy, that it made one. it look so different, that didn't it? My camera girl mucked up. Camera operator. Co cam it's not a girl. Camera. That would be sexist. Like, okay, there she is. <laughs> That's the one. She, she was looking at her shirt when she did it. <laughs> is this what I copy from? One down. Um, invented statement exists only in the imagination. Uh, what of the imagination? Figment. Figment. It's Figment, right. And just watch it over there. <laughs> bit like, um, a bit like racism, you know. That's just the pigment of the imagination. <laughs> <laughs> Across. Six across. This is the man who pushed the pole and made the boat go through Venice. Gondola. The gondolier. Well. Gondolier. <laughs> Gondoleur. <laughs> One who gondols. Oh. Yeah. I, uh. Oh, I left out the D. <laughs> oh, bum. <laughs> Don't worry, I'm getting there. Three down. I'm sorry. No, you're not. Three down. Um, I don't know what I'm oh. doing. I'm glad you did three down and not two down. Bent. <laughs> Crooked. <laughs> stoned. Stoned. stoned, someone's yelling out. Stoned, no, that's what happens to people in the old days when they did a sin, they would be stoned to death. <laughs> what better than the gas chamber, I should think. Um, okay. Yes, bent. Did they Crooked. It? They got it. They got it. Absolutely. Got it in one. Okay, seven across. Seven across, this is the most holy of the four holy books of Islam. El... Oh dear. La ilaha illallah, Muhammadan Rasulullah, the... Cross. No, the... No, that's a tribe in Burma. Getting close though. Did you say Quran? El Quran. Okay. Five down. El, El, the Quran. Salam alaikum. Where are we going? Take a long walk off a short. Bridge. Pier, oh. you're right, absolutely. Nice. <laughs> yeah, she said Pier, she was right. <laughs> oh, what's going on? Oh. 
Uh, no, if you look at two down, they'd never get that. No. Boredom, ennui. I don't think so. Sorry, guys. I no, don't. No, wouldn't have got, got that, got would it. we? So tomorrow, though, you can come back tomorrow and have a go. Excellent. Great. Keith, though, you coming back tomorrow, man? I will be back, John. Cool, baby. Why don't you play us out with some of that funky stuff, man? This is Crazy Crossword Ted's saying. Coming at you. Hoo, hoo, hoo. That's what we're that saying. Good night. Good night. La la salama. Crosswords. Crazy crosswords. Computer gear. That's right, ladies and gentlemen. Our young job. food is provided by Rabbits. Our drinks by Osborne Soft Drinks. Mobile clothes from Sports Scouts. Steel scrolls from my cupboard. Uh, dry cleaning by Blue Line Dry Cleaning at Karina. Thank you very much. Audience seating from Aloha Party High. Computer graphics from Mac Animations. Audio and lighting from iTunes. Concert sound and lighting. Props and costumes from the Cosm Team Company. Audience giveaways from Porter Home Video. Cast and crew to supply black box airlines and prefer to stay at base motels right around Australia. This has been an Australian television production production for the Bristol 31 Network. Eric Frackman speaking. This program proudly brought to you by Rebbits, Mary Ram, and LOA's The Family Music Store. Guten Tag, wie geht es Ihnen? La 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 la. La 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 la.